Good morning, guys. This is another farm that Chris has picked up. Farmer Chris has picked up. It's being converted from pasture ground over to crop ground. And we got a few fence rows and a few minor things we need to do to get it ready for him to farm or farm as much of it as he possibly can. But the fields themselves are not in too bad a shape. The challenge, the challenge on this one is the access to the property. So as you guys will see here a little bit later in the video, we're going to put our new uh, clay pipe hook to the test, see if we can get the driveway widened out and uh, get Farmer Chris and his bigger equipment up and down the driveway. But we do have uh, two small fence rows to get knocked out and then over the hill we go. Let's hit the ground and get started. Let's get this party started this morning. First things first, we need to make uh, these two two fields in the wall. We've got a little bit of short fence row right here. I just want to be super careful we do not end up with a whole bunch of wob wire wrapped up in a track. Mary went down through there and cut most Go of it. Right in there somewhere and grab onto it. I left the first kind of long. Trying to get this bob wire picked up out of here. Don't want to get it in the track. We're also going to try to save what T posts we can. Some of them are going to be unsavable, but. Stuff, especially whenever it gets all growed up in the in everything. But I think we got her. Nice. Not sure if I got enough machine to pull that bush out. Me, the pole stripping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we that one. That's pretty good odds, though. All right, put this down in the woods. And we'll go back and we we'll get those poles pulled out of there. Fence post removing business. Yeah. <laughs> I got a feeling when this is over, one of those fence posts is going to be a lawn dart. <laughs> yeah, that was a little crooked. Alright, Aaron's gonna make a couple quick passes up and down that way, just kind of clean up the last little 
scrub stuff a little bit. We want to make sure there's no fence post or anything hidden down in there. Last thing we want to happen is Chris come across here with his high dollar planter and catch something. So. Skim the ground one good time. Make sure we got everything cleaned up. We're going to move on to the next one. Fires on BL550. He's getting pretty, uh, pretty slick with her. They used to split them up between horse and cattle, I believe, so that's why they had everything divided up. So obviously you don't have to worry about your corn getting loose, so you don't need fences for that. <laughs> You're in charge, what's the plan? Oh. Well, only thing I want to do is make sure we don't damage that deer stand. Yeah, there is a nice little deer stand hunting in there. It's like it's almost camouflaged. Yeah. Oh. Uh, you think they want to stick out, be easier to find. <laughs> 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 well, you know, they do sit in it wearing orange. Yeah, true. True. Uh, anyways. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, man, I don't. <laughs> this, we may have to work together. Yeah, yeah, it's, get some of that it's, going. It's just, it's just uh, not working this morning. I'm thinking it might be easier to uh, work together on this. Work one. together. Work together. That's what we do best. Yeah, a team. We'll work we'll together. So I'm thinking like I'll go through and I'll cut and then probably just have you try to rip out what you can. Okay. Um, what then, if I go down through there? Are they a metal post or a wood post? They're, they're, uh, they're a mixture of both, but most of them are metal. What if I so go down through there next to each post and just reap in, reach in there and grab the wire and try to raise it up? And then what I don't rip in two, you cut, we'll just do each post, try to get the wire out of there and come back, clean up the brush. Yeah. Wanna try it? Let's give it a shot. All right, I think I'm ready. You got a gate right here, right off the bat. I want to start right here. And make a nice little deep ball. Once I get too much I can't hold, then you'll cut it off and I'll set it off the side and we'll go again. Great minds think alike. I thought about that, then you agreed. <laughs> you know, it's, it's uh, you got post, you got tree post, you got metal post, and I'm probably going to have some snake post in this mess. Snakes, and if I can get my hand on one, it's coming in the cab with you. See, I like this. This is working smarter, not harder. You're doing it all, and I can watch. This is like working smarter and not working at all. However you want to say it, I'm going to say it the way I want to say it. You already cut that? Nope, never cut it, but you did. Ah, with the 210, you may not need me. I like this.
keep us going, they don't kill me well. Why don't you hop on the bed time and see if you can get that pile pushed out of my way so I don't get bound up my brush. All right, 10-4. That means I got to do something. Exactly. I really thought this fence was going to be a bigger issue than what it is. I think what's saving us with that. I think what's saving us is it's grown into so many different trees. Whenever I pull on, I'm able to rip it in two, which is a huge benefit for us. Looks like that worked pretty good, didn't it? fast the well no issues with the wire at all i don't think there's any point of going much farther this turns into a great big old ditch and uh chris farm some hillsides but i don't think he's gonna be able to uh get his tractor through that so let Aaron get this last little bit pushed off here we'll get what we got cleaned up and we'll hop over and get the other half morning farmer chris oh running wild already this don't look much like a tree that's not a tree is it no it's definitely not a tree yeah and i made this fancy little jig to lift those up i didn't come through derby <laughs> Guess what? i, I did see it sitting down there <laughs> all right so this is part two of this job we got some uh what driveway expansion going driveway on driveway expansion yeah for sure that's you know you could field farm some fields just right off the highway that are flat one of these days well, that's why Farmer Chris gets some of these fields and the whales wants them. All right, we're going to get this unloaded for now. Go back and finish up our fence row, and then uh, we're going to try to get that. we got a ditch culvert we basically got to extend so Farmer Chris can get up the driveway. you got one goal, though. Get that off the trailer in one piece. Yeah, well, if I had the 120, that would not be an issue. Yeah, but that's, uh, that's I've got a little more pep in my step on this one. Born. You don't have to be that gentle on those hay bales. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how far we can throw them. Well, this is the uh tail of two sides right here this side looks pretty good and farmable yeah this side not so much this is my side that's your side <laughs> mine's good to go <laughs> that actually went pretty pretty well actually yeah it did not uh too many major issues so all right well, all, them, uh, all them fence posts were all rusted and rotted out so i didn't see no point in saving they them were, it, they've been there for a long time yeah i think somebody's already got their money's worth out of them <laughs> yeah, <they did. laughs> yeah i think uh, i think the barbed wire the trees were holding the barbed wire more well, the i agree i were. agree so all right we're gonna hammer down get this side knocked out and then we gotta get on our driveway project all right
There you have it guys, fence row is all out. Looks nice, I was making a few passes just kind of cleaning up. Farmer Chris showed up, he uh, moved the one random beer stand that was still in there, but we're gonna track back around to the front side and uh, get started on this driveway widening project. Well, got the jewel out. You got here. the jewel out. Yeah, this is gonna be a good little test run before we get to the big job. Yeah, yeah. It so is. did it balance right there good? That, you beat me that too. That balance is good. That's the one. I think we did. Didn't we show them how we? That was in the crane and shop. Yeah, on the crane. So that was all good. So what do you think? We're gonna jump over one or two? Well, I don't know. Uh, I say let's jump over. See what happens. See what happens. All right, let's do it. Got your radio just hanging on that glass there. <laughs> Man, that's what I was getting ready to say. I think I can go back to that other one. See what it does as far as leveling it out. This right here. This... Yeah, just like a quick, you know, like a hook. There you go. That's that's pretty close there. Yep. So. All right. All right. Let me just see how hard it is for me. Yeah, yeah, I think it is. I even picked that up one, I know I am a lot stronger than you, but I, I handled that one handed to get it in there. So, yeah. yeah, I think it'll work. All right, now the only problem is we gotta go put it where it belongs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, how the driveway we go? All right. All right, man, behind the scenes. Man, that thing, that's just a thing of beauty right there hanging. Yeah, it is. That's gonna work out good for our big job. Another masterpiece we built. <laughs> <laughs> we need to paint it, we need to paint it. It needs to look good. It look good. Yeah. All right, so can you see the little crook in the driveway? Farmer Chris basically needs to go straight right here. So what we need to do, as I guess we're gonna have to dig down and be very gentle and not damage this other pipe. We're gonna to try to slide that plastic pipe into that clay pipe right there. That's where it could get fun. <laughs> yeah, we got way too big a machine for this operation. <laughs> way way too big a machine. Please. All right, well, let's set that thing off to the side. I think you're gonna to have to do me a little guiding. Uh, We'll get dug back and see what yep. can make it happen. <laughs> I'm like literally going to be digging underneath myself. Yeah. I'm sure it'll be fine. Dig it out under you. That's <laughs> <laughs> I don't really have an option. I guess I could go down in there and try to straddle the ditch, but 
I want to make a bigger mess than what I need to. Yeah. All right, let's see what happens. That is a root, ain't it? Yeah, no worries. That's uh, just a root, no water line. But it does look similar to a two-inch water line. You're staying a safe distance away from it. You're about a uh, eight inches from it. Now up, up a little bit. Up, yep, right like that. Up, up, stop, stop. Let me see where we're at here. A root cracking. Yeah. Man, behind the scenes, I can't believe you put a hole in that thing with a shovel. I didn't mean to. I don't think that was us. No, I don't think so. I think the previous installer did that. That is definitely not a new cut. So. Not only that, the way we were grabbing in the angle, we couldn't do that if we tried. No. Uh, so what are, what's our plan here? <laughs> I was hoping you had one. Ah. Uh, <laughs> uh. I, I do not like the way they backfilled around this. No. Uh, I say we... Uh, I don't know if they can see the backfill. I say we get that other side carved out a little bit, and if we can get that clay to slide up on there far enough to go past that, I think we'll be good, don't you? Yeah. The question is, is it worth... I don't know. I guess we need to keep notching out over there. Yeah. All right, we're just going to have to keep taking it easy here. One little rock at a time. Get this cleaned out around there, and hopefully we get that clay slid up on there. Hold that. Pull back to you a little bit. There you go. What if I just do a piece on the end of there trying to make it longer? You just want to grab that little piece out, little piece out of there and then try to get notched around what's still in the bank? Yeah. I, I know we could leave it would be even better yet, but uh, if we have to, yeah, we can take it out. Man behind the scenes, hindsight being 2020, I think we should have talked to Farmer Chris into a whole new pipe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, we did finally, I don't know what's busted that pipe. We found two more busts in it with the shovel, which we know is not us. But we did get dug all the way around it enough. I think we can slide. We've been digging. Can you tell we're both out of breath? Yeah. I think we can get our clay pipe slid on there now. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're just gonna have to call it good. <laughs> Them big rocks, that back billing they did wasn't very good. That jars your wrist pretty good. I'm pretty sure I know what contractor put this in. It don't surprise me one bit. <laughs> all right, all we can do at this point is make the best out of it. So let's uh, slide a pipe on.
it. We got water running through. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're underneath now. Are you, your plan is try to push it in. All right, so we got to go ahead and pull this out. All right. I'm ready when you are. Oh, that's good. I like it. There we go. Hey, behind the scenes, this is good old fashioned. Use what you got to make it work. Yeah. So, I climbed up in the pipe there. I don't know if you guys can see because GoPro is sucking low light. We actually got some really nice rocks stacked up around with the two combined. Hopefully, I'll keep it from suck holing. It's not the perfect joint, but. I think it'll work. Oh, yeah. I'm on the scenes. You're getting a little carried away with your stone work here. This is not Stonehenge, buddy. No, no. But it does I look do. good, don't it? Yeah. All right. Let's uh, let's see if we can get the truck past there without yep. falling in the hole. That's gonna be the next. That's part. the next one. Yeah. No kidding. Oh, okay. Yeah, real close. You were pushing hard with that left. Or with your right, I mean, my left. Looking good. Alright, got that. You had a couple inches to spare. Coming on back. A little more. All right, let's uh, hold that. How how sturdy you think that bank is? You're about a uh, foot. Stay there. on going a little more Keep on going all right hold that that'll be enough to get us started right there your uh, passenger side up front. Rear, you're good. As soon as you can start cutting it to your left, be good. All right on that rock. All right, keep on coming back. I go back far enough, I can redo it here. Yeah.
I knew you'd say it. bit more. Alright, let's go with that right there. <laughs> yeah, it might. Yeah, just watch that bucket. You're good on your passenger side. You're looking good. Yeah, coming on back. Yeah, it is. We may have to make one more dump. I'm not sure if that'll get it. It's going to be close. Back up there, dumped. I'd be so far off level to have the bed so much higher. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you got it. You're about a, uh, yeah, I'd stop right there.
Right there is about good. Probably have you dump a little pile and then I'll have you uh, slowly move up a little bit. Coming up in the bed a little bit. Now so we're going up, up, drop it. Alright, now you want to put a one more little pile right there. Um, I don't know, can you uh, get turned like you were the last time and dump pretty well in the exact same spot? Oh, you're off a bad meeting. Well, I know, I just liked where that was at. Yeah, I think, yeah, we'll be able to get it. Get the wheels cut. All right, right there. All right, drop your bed. All right, I think that's going to be enough to get it finished up. Okay, boy, look at this truck out there. All right. get it now. All right, I think we're going to have just the right amount of rock to finish this off the way we want. Look pretty good, ain't it? Oh, yeah. All right, there it is, guys. All done. That turned out. That actually turned out very nice for uh, for the cards we're dealt. What we had to uh, deal with. Landowner just come by. He is tickled to death with it. I guess he's had a few guys come up here and get hay and fall off in this ditch as well. So it's going to help out everybody involved. But uh, we got her. Looks good. We got one little bitty field entrance, I guess it would be, at the top of the hill to uh, get knocked out. And uh, this one's going to be a wrap. All right, here is the last thing on the list. Right down there is where we are working. This road comes up, makes a 90, and then goes up and around the house. There is no way to get semis, tractors farm equipment up through there so the plan is to come up and basically go straight through this fence right here we've got a little bit of a ditch so we need to throw those two pipes in here get some rock on them get the rest of that fence out get this opened up that way they can come up the driveway and just uh go straight on through so let's do this one the easy way bam i got some serious magic that's black rock yeah <laughs> <laughs> i bet they didn't see that one coming yeah the uh long story short but our local rock supplier just sucks i'm gonna leave it at that yeah we got this from pennsylvania remember the black rock up there it's a derby pennsylvania yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right that's gonna be a wrap on this one guys we got just a nice little contour hump here what i'm worried about is i don't want a bunch of water coming off this hill jumping this berm and end up going down his driveway so the water should kind of go around should give uh chris access in and out of the field fence rows removed other culvert in, mission complete. Yeah, best right. part was I took that one uh, 
berm out or whatever that no, is. No, they didn't even see that. I have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, I know they missed the best part. We only record the important stuff. <laughs> they disagree. <laughs> they missed the list. <laughs> All right. We are, uh, we're going to get everything staged because tomorrow, if you're going to find this hard to believe, we're moving on to the next one. Yeah, so. we are. All right. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you did, give it a big old thumbs up. Want to make sure you don't miss out on what the next one is. If you haven't subscribed yet, I consider doing that. So we can catch you on the next one. Later.